you're going to go to File, and then Print. And the print window shows up. I'm connected to the printer. And from here, if you are familiar with the printing process with Lightroom, uh, you might see something familiar too after this window, by the way. You like to make sure that the printer is selected. So this is the printer that I'm using. You can change the layout, orientation, vertical, horizontal. And then you like to look into color management. Color 100, you would like to Photoshop manages colors instead of printer manages colors. Photoshop manages colors. After all, you're in the Photoshop and then you are given the control on Photoshop. Printer profile, you like to go and choose the profile based on the printer and the paper that you're using. That was Epson P800, if I can find it. Okay, here it is. P800 series premium photo paper glossy. So this is the same color profile that I proofed with, basically. And I'm going to still use the same proofing settings. I, I, I was at the relative color metric, so I choose the relative all the way through. Check the black point compensation. This file is 16 bits. So I'm going to go ahead and send 16-bit data, too. So here, also you can actually see gamut warning here, too, under here. So if you like to see the gamut warning, which is no gamut on here, but if you see, if you like to see it, check it, and if gray shows up, that is out of gamut colors. If a lot of amount is out of gamuts, then you really need to reconsider to adjust it. So there are a lot more things below, but you don't have to go there. All you really need to be concerned with is the color management part. This is the most important part, color management. And after you set up this area, you like to go to Print Settings. That's the final touch. Uh-oh. That's a color. This one is what I need to do. So this is the printer side of the window that you need to set up. Layout, Printer Settings. And from here, if you're familiar with Lightroom printing, you know this. Paper size, US letter, that is what I would like to print on. Paper source, sheet paper, we're not printing on the matte paper or thick paper, so sheet feeder, that is what you like to use. Media type, the glossy paper. And all the other things are unchoosable because I'm setting up everything in the Photoshop side. So Photoshop manages color. And the output resolution, super fine, is what you like to have. Uncheck the high speed. Finest detail, if you want to you can check it but I, I don't really see the differences I compare the two and then I my bare eye cannot really see the differences but if you feel like you like to get the finest detail maybe check and then you feel better too and then I'll save the settings and I'm ready to make prints but I should probably load the paper too so come around here Especially if you are new to using the printer, come closer to.